Hi guys, uh, today we will be doing a camera comparison test uh, between the Hubson Zeno Mini Pro and the DJI Mini 2 on uh, this uh, familiar bridge on my channel. So first thing first, uh, we will look into the uh, settings of the camera. So I'm with my Hubson Zeno Mini Pro now. So I have to tune the ISO to 400, uh, which is uh, much more natural uh, to the FPV screen that I'm seeing and um, the shutter speed I'll keep it at 1 over 60 and today we'll be recording at 4k uh, 30 frames uh, let me turn on the grid lines uh, just to align the the drone okay and um, so this has a bigger aperture so even at uh, 400 ISO uh, you can pretty much see the bridge uh, pretty lit up I'm also uh, using a spot mode on the uh, Hubson Zeno Mini Pro because uh, the distance to the bridge is pretty far so I need to get there like have a cinematic shot that is uh, much faster because this drone travel pretty small slow so the color setting I'll go with ordinary uh, you can watch my previous video on the differences of that and the white balance I'm tuning it uh, as close to what I see on with my eyes uh, on the bridge so it is roughly a 4200 so other than that, I think we are okay to go with uh, the Hubson Zeno Mini Pro. Uh, so let us uh, pick up speed. So do notice during a spot mode, um, this camera is uh, pretty stable with the gimbal. And I'm trying to do a braking and turning to my left and look at the altitude ball. Uh, it's uh, moving around, but uh, your footage is still uh, stable. Okay, so up next uh, we have the DJI Mini 2. Let us uh, turn it into sport mode also. And uh, we will see uh, the uh, settings for the camera. I'll try to uh, switch the uh, white balance to what suits my eye. I'm turning on the grid line as well. Um, just to match what I see on the bridge, the color. So it's a bit different than that of the Hubsen Zeno Mini Pro. So this one, uh, it's at about 6,000. Yeah, 6,000 looks about right to my eye. So the main difference of uh, both of these cameras is that the Hubsen Zeno Mini Pro has a larger sensor size and also it has a f1.8 aperture, whereas uh, the Hub DJI Mini 2 has a, a smaller aperture at uh, 2.8. So the main difference uh, in low light situation is uh, very apparent. So here I'm uh, choosing the uh, ISO. I might have to move it up a bit because it's too dark. So shutter speed will keep it at 1 over 60, which is the supposed the best uh, situation for capturing videos. Uh, so in sport mode, you can see that the, the gimbal will tilt down for the DJI Mini so there's no way I can record that so that's uh, enough of talking uh, we'll look into the footage